So hangers are very important. Now, a lot of people don't pay attention to hangers, and they put pants on shirt hangers and shirts on pant hangers. But it's very important to keep everything organized. Now, if you can tell here. All of my pants are on hangers that look like this. So you either have two clips at the side, and I'm going to show you what that looks like with a pair of pants. And now this way, you can actually see everything elongated, so you don't have to guess what you're pulling out of the closet. Now this is the other type of hanger where it bends back, and these are great because if you don't have a lot of room, you can fit about three or four different pants. In this one hanger, so what I suggest is go out and buy about ten pant hangers, ten skirt hangers, and keep them all together like so. This way, they're all the same exact length, and you'll find everything much easier. Okay. So now all of these hangers, okay, like I said, this is a great skirt hanger because I like seeing everything that I want to wear, okay. And if I can't see it, then I'm not going to wear it. So I put a skirt like this in the hanger, but you can put about three or four of these in one hanger. Now this closet is pretty small, so we have to utilize all of the space that we have. So another type of hanger that I don't have in here is one that actually latches down, where you can put a skirt here, a skirt here. A skirt here and maybe pants here. Now that's what you do when you have a small closet like this, okay? And you want all of your hangers to line up. You don't want any dry cleaning hangers. Dry cleaning hangers are wires and they don't last. So you want to make sure when you do dry clean your clothes, you throw out all the wire hangers and you rehang them on hangers that you bought.